They're innovative. They're creative. They're also blue. Talking to those jolly nice chaps. The Blue Man Group. Tell us about how this came about and how you got to be on the Moby Area 2 tour. It's from doing the Grammys about, um, what was it, two years ago two we years did the ago, Grammys. Yeah. We played uh, Natural, was it Natural, Natural Blues? Blues? Natural right. Blues with right. him and Jill Scott also at the Grammys. Yeah. It was just one of those crazy, you know, who, who would have thought that these three different virgin artists got, we could get together and do it, but it was great. So when people ask us, you know, how do you get to be on the Area 2 tour, we just say, you know, you do the Grammys with Moby. What does it take to be a blue man? It's not the easiest thing. It's uh, because it, you have to be able to drum. You have to take a written test. It's very difficult. Yeah. They're pretty talented. They can do anything. <laughs> Let's talk more about some of the instruments, the organic things that they produce from literally nothing, a piece of piping, a piece of old wood. I think part of the concept of the Blue Man thing is uh, them sort of being an outsider taking in our culture, but they don't have the instruments to, to create the music, so they have sort of take what they can find. For this, the, the Blue Man instrument is a group of drummers. It's like synthesizer-like parts that they're playing naturally, you know, organically with these with these tube instruments. And uh, it's just, you know, putting those instruments, blending them with the, the regular instruments. Actually, sorry about And that. cell phones. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Most of the tech is just, is, this, is that crazy blue man, in, you know, in industrial stuff. I think one of the biggest challenges we have also are all the PVC tubes don't make that much noise, so miking them, you know, we've had to do a lot of R&D to get them actually even audible over loud guitars and basses and all the drummers and everything. There's a, there's a lot of sound, there's yeah. a lot of, of uh, intense sound material. Just the drums alone, the amount of, of uh, audio inputs is out of control. A big part of the Blue Man Group is not just the stage performance, but the recordings, two records out so far. Yeah. Tell us about the latest recording. On the new record, the big question we were wondering is, can these plumbing-based instruments and these industrial instruments, would they actually work as, as pop songs? Dave Matthews sang on one song and it came out great. Should be out hopefully in what February there? February. And February. I think February. the plan is upon releasing it will go on the road. Next year is gonna have a lot more intense video and light tech that's gonna be there's a lot of video stuff. And so if I learn to to juggle some toilet roll and pour wine doing an interview and also make an instrument out of piping, do you think maybe I could be that's a part a, of the group? That's yeah. the game, if you can yeah. juggle, tell a few jokes. Thank you.